Can I call you Rose? Cause you're sweet like a flower in bloom. Can I call you Rose? So first, let's use this background music. The music is entitled, Can I Call You Rose? Then total of 7 row video clips. So let's use this first. Then drag it on the working space. Then right click and click mute. So our goal here is to match it on the beat. So when the beat, so when the part of the beat or the music will pop out it will change another video it will change into another video so like this one so there will be total of seven video clips For the last part, I'll just cut it. Since the music is quite long. And now, select the first clip. And then, go to color. Then adjust the temperature to 20. And then saturation to 10. And after that, go to HSL. And for the HSL, click the orange first. Then for the U, 19. Then saturation to 18. And for the luminance, leave it. Then onto the next color yellow. For the U, negative 43. Then saturation to 24. And for the last one is color green. For the U, negative 76. Then saturation 28. And after that, go to curves. And for the curves, we will be using color red and blue only. So adjust it based on your preference. But the goal is to have a touch of color yellow. So it's up to you. And after that, save as custom since we will be applying it on all of the clips let's try to save it again and then select all the clips and after that click the preset number 4 the custom preset that we have that we've saved earlier and after that go to titles and for the titles, there are keywords that you can use like this mood social media. And there are different resources that you can try and apply it on your 
video like this one this colorful colorful moods and let's try another another keyword is happy yellow like this one like this happy yellow title 4 this is perfect for your cinematic videos another one is happy yellow title 2 you can use this one let's try another keyword search for comic strip title if you want your videos to look like comic style or cartoon style you can use this one but for the last I'll be using the travel in Germany you search it and you can see different sources like this travel in Germany title just click it and wait for it to be finished downloading so it will look like this but I'll be using this travel in Germany title since this video is cinematic style So I'll be using this one, I'll drag it on the working space, so let's adjust this screen for you to be able to see it clearly. So for the duration, I'll just put it until the 3 seconds, first 3 seconds of the video so I'll delete the other parts of the text like this unterrytale I'll delete this one then change the titles let's try to put exploring Asia and then change the color then click advance for us to apply some shadow then adjust the blur the distance then adjust the size as well for it to be seen then another one, same process, change the color as well as the text. I'll just put my name here. And for the last one, I'll put food and travel. So once done, so put some shadow and once done click apply. So it will look like this. I'll adjust it. I adjust this one. For it to be able to For it to be able to what do you call this? To maximize the entire screen.
so I can't adjust this one I forgot that I already inserted the text title and for the last go to solid color in the stock media category and then choose color black then go to mask then click circle then invert mask then adjust its width and height and the blur strength as I said earlier the goal is to match the effect on the beat of the music so I'll just copy this one and then I'll adjust the masking so I'll put it on the lower on the middle lower part then copy again and for the third one I'll put it on the upper right corner So there will be total of 7 masking but This time I'll be putting on the lower right Like this then copy again Then put it at the middle upper part like this one then copy again that put it on the lower left corner and for the last one we will be putting it at the middle so adjust the mask also the blur strength I'll be adjusting it but I'll be putting some keyframe for this one so there will be a so there will be an effect like from dark to light so we'll be matching it on the beat lastly go to effects then search for retro then apply it on the remaining video clips like this So let's see. After you render preview, here's the result. Can I call you Rose?